tired, wet, cold. They're just shoveling stuff down. That night at the briefing, a uh, lieutenant colonel from SOCOM, I believe he was a lieutenant colonel. Nobody's wearing rank. These And these are all volunteers, so it's hard to tell. But he got up and he said, you know, everybody knew who this guy was. Obviously a legend. And he got up and he said, guys, I've been in special operations for 30 years, 30 plus years running ops with you guys. And he said, we all work together. I've worked with a lot of you in a lot of capacities, doing a lot of crazy things and killing a lot of crazy people, whatever. And he said, but gentlemen, there are operations that you will never forget and that will stay with you the rest of your lives. And he said that this was one of the most important and powerful missions he ever did. And he was proud to be a part of it. And there wasn't a dry eye in that room. It was incredible. Terry, the Vietnam veteran, God, he's got to be like 70 years old. Uh, I think I have a picture of him here. Uh, volunteered his aircraft. He's from First Cav, flown Vietnam. I don't know how many missions Terry flew, but Terry... Uh, was in the air every single day. Still is. He's still there. 